subscribe and hit the bell icon for more notifications. Hi friends, welcome back to West Word Study. This year, around 13 lakh students have given NEET exam and now it's time for results. NTA has officially announced that on 12th of October, that is today, it is going to announce the results by end of the day. End of the day, you are going to get your results okay so now let's see how to check your results you need to go to the official website ndaneet.nic.in then after clicking on that after going to that official website there will be a link with the name NEET 2020 results you just need to click on it and after clicking on it you have to enter all your correct credentials such as registration number and password once you give your current credentials and click on submit or ok then your results will be there the results will be displayed online you can also take the printout of your score so, so now let's see how many seats are available in top government colleges this year coming to AIMS Delhi AIMS stands for All India Institute of Medical Sciences New Delhi okay coming to AIMS New Delhi 106 seats are available Coming to Maulana Azad Medical College, New Delhi, 250 seats are available. Coming to University College of Medical Sciences, that is University of Delhi, 170, totally 170 seats are available. Coming to King George Medical University, Lucknow, 250 seats are available. Coming to Jawaharlal Institute of Postgraduate Medical Education and Research, 200 seats are available. Coming to Institute of Medical Sciences, Benares Hindu University, 100 seats are available. Coming to Government Medical College and Hospital Chandigarh, 148 seats are available. Coming to Armed Force Medical College, Pune, 150 seats are available. Coming to Lady Hardinge Medical College for Women, New Delhi, 232 seats are available. Coming to Andhra Medical College, Visakhapatnam, 250 seats are available. Okay, so now let's see what is the opening and closing rank for government colleges. Coming to Maulala Azad Medical College, New Delhi, opening rank is 1 and closing rank is 40. Coming to Bangalore Medical College, opening rank is 4 and closing rank is 760. Coming to Government Medical College, Kottayam, opening rank is 18 and closing rank is 614, 614. Coming to Government Medical College, Surat, opening rank is 20 and closing rank is 2000. Coming to Seth GS Medical College, which is in Mumbai, the opening rank is 26 and closing rank is 200. Coming to Government Medical College, Tiruvannandapuram, opening rank is 32 and closing rank is 530. Coming to MS Benares Hindu University, Varanasi, opening rank is 42 and closing rank is 180 which is 180. Coming to Lady Hardin Medical College, New Delhi, opening rank is 42 and closing rank is 125. 1, 2, 5. Okay. So, coming to University College of Medical Sciences, Delhi, opening rank is 46 and closing rank is 112. 1, 1, 2. Okay. Last but not least, Government Medical College opening rank is 50 and closing rank is 440. Okay. So, now let's see what is the cutoff for NEET 2020 category wise. Okay. So, now let's see. Coming to UR, unreserved category, 50 percentile is the cutoff and coming to marks wise cutoff, your mark should be in between 710 to 100 and 150, okay. So, cutoff for UR is going to be in between 130 to 710, okay. So, coming to SC 
ST and OBC in terms of percentile the cutoff is 40 okay 40 percentile is the cutoff and in terms of marks you, you should get marks in between 100 to 120 cutoff is going to be in between 100 to 120 okay so coming to UR and P, UR PH 45 is the percentile cutoff and coming to marks marks should be in between 95 to 120 okay now let's see for how many marks how much rank you're going to get okay so if you get a particular marks how much rank you may get okay so now let's see that marks versus rank so if your marks are above 700 your rank is going to be in between 1 to 2 okay and if your marks are in between 690 to 700 your rank is going to be in between 2 to 20 okay you can get you you have the chances to get the rank in between 2 and 20 okay so if your marks are in between 680 to 690 you can get the rank in between 20 to 98 okay if your marks are in between 670 to 670 to 680 your rank is going to be in between 90 to 200 okay if your marks are in between 50 to 670 your rank will be about 200 and below 450 okay if your marks are in between 650 to 660 your marks are going to be about your rank is going to be above 500 and below 900 okay if your marks are in between 650 640 to 650 your rank is going to be above 900 and below and below 1700 okay if your marks are above if if your marks are in between 630 to 640 your rank is going to be above 1500 and below 2500 okay so if your marks are in between 620 to 560 rank is going to be about 2500 and below 19000 okay so like this based on your marks your rank will be decided so yeah that's it for today hope you found this video useful all the very best for future doctors uh, i wish i sincerely wish that you all get a very great result for more such kind of neat updates don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that whenever i make a new video you will be notified don't forget to like and share this video with all your friends the more likes the more support we will get to just support our channel please like and subscribe also don't forget to share this video with all your friends so all the very best to your career 